Okay, I just had it idling, I just started it. And uh, this is the complete bike now. And uh, obviously there's just still a little minor tune-ups, you know. And it's only just, a, uh, you know, like just adjusting the brakes, you know, just very minor things. And then, um, let's go through it a little bit. Uh, I've had a few just issues with this uh, chain guard. I initially had it on the other side of the of the frame here, and it actually got caught onto the chain, and it just took out a little a little bit of a nick out of the guard there. So, so I've just basically transferred it onto the other side. I just had to grind. You know the top of the guard and you know, just so it suits for the frame there and I initially had to take out the you know the, the top of the guard there just to clear the tire but that was before I you know swapped it over so now <laughs> this part is sort of unnecessary but, and that's basically just been the minor issue and and when I first started starting it up and just taking it for a little test so the chain just wasn't aligning properly so it just needs needs to be just minor adjustments you just gotta to try to get this pretty much square where you just gotta fiddle around with the tightening and loosening the those nuts and bolts so it actually runs really square um, See, there's the nuts there, and then what else? Oh, uh, this tap has to be when it's not in use, just turn it off so it doesn't flood the, the motor out. Um, so far, it's uh, it, it has been easier to it has been easy to start. You, you know, if you're just gonna starting stop position where you just gotta flip the flip the pedal uh, you probably need a little bit of a little bit of muscle power there because you gotta lift the the back wheel off the off the um, off the ground and, and if you're a, I think if you if you sort of don't have the the physical strength in lifting the bike up and then you know and flicking the pedal you just may need to just to ride it, you know, once you have it, you know, once you're riding, you know, recent, at a reasonable pace, you just, uh, just drop the clutch and it will actually start to fire up, so you can do it that way, it's like just j jump, jump starting. Um, yeah, so I initially, in the, in the manual, it's got the um, the fuel the fuel ratios with with the oil mix at sixteen to one as the initial just for the running period uh, and so it is a little bit smoky at the moment but but after the I'm gonna probably run it at that at that ratio for probably about two or three tanks and then I'll just sort of increase it to twenty to one and I. Then after about 500 k's, which is probably about the probably about the fourth or fifth tank, and I'll, um, I can run it at about 25 to one. So, so initially you just gotta uh, as the motor sort of loosening up, all the components are just starting to yeah. It's better to run it at at the at a more uh, denser oil mix. Uh, oh yeah, the other thing I've done is I've actually covered the you know the wires. Uh, it says in the manual it's it's not needed to, but you know, they just sort of it just looked a bit daggy, just having too many. You know, three or four wires just sort of hanging loose. I'd just rather condense it down to one. You know, 
and that is pretty much it. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video, and uh, and I show you in the last video that I do, you know, this uh, me test riding it up and down the street. Anyway, hope hopefully you enjoy. Cheers, bye.